Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. As you guys read the title, this is going to be a 30 facts about me. So if you want to know more about me, then just keep on watching. By the way, you guys, if you guys want to learn how, you know, I did this fishtail braid, don't forget to check out my last video about it, a hair tutorial. So I will go ahead and leave the link in the description box so you guys can go check that out. Fact number one, I do not have a middle name. My name is just Marlene Magical and that's it. My parents decided no middle name for her. My sister has a middle name, my brother has a middle name, Nelly has a middle name, Brian has a middle name. I don't have a middle name. Fact number two, I have three siblings. My little sister is um, full blood, my brother is my stepbrother, and my other sister is my stepsister. But you know, I consider them all brothers and sisters, so nothing different. Fact number three, I used to be a hardcore shuffler in ninth grade. So back then, it was a thing. I used to love shuffling, and people used to be like, damn, you're so good, and stuff like that. I believe there's also like a video on YouTube shuffling at my school, or um, high school was campus. There's like a video, we had like these little scholar themes, and they started playing like little techno, electro, like music, and then they like filmed me shuffling. <laughs> so weird. Fact number four. I have gotten in trouble with the cops before. If you guys would like a story time about that, let me know in the comment section below. Number five. I am double jointed. So my fingers, they are super crooked. Like if I go like this, like crooked. 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 Like I can lift my fingers so weird. I used to be able to put my this finger all the way back. Fact number six. Throughout my whole life, I've only had three dogs, one fish, and one turtle. Um, I had Fifi, Muñeca, and Zeus. Zeus was my most recent one. Fifi and Muñeca. They were not like my my dogs, but my aunt had them where I would be taking care of the dogs. So um, that's why I count them as my pets. My fish, his name was Nino. He died, unfortunately. And my turtle, we named him Squirt. I've, like, I'm, I never had that many pets. Fact number seven, I used to have really thick eyebrows. So right now, I mean, they're like thick, I guess, but when I was more young, my eyebrows were a thick girl. Like, they were thick. Crazy. It runs in my family, I guess. Like, my sister has thick eyebrows. My dad has thick eyebrows. Fact number eight, I like to draw. I have not drawn in a very long time. I used to have an art class in high school and I used to take it serious. I actually have uh, pictures of my work, so I'll show you guys. But um, yeah, I used to like it. I'm the type of person though that I have to look and then I'll like, like look at a picture and then I'll like draw it and then look and draw. Like I won't like, copy and like put the paper on top of the, the actual like picture no like I can actually just look at something and then draw it out and usually that's how um, I work best fact number nine I've had purple hair before I had more like an ombre purple hair if you go onto my Instagram and see like some of my old photos that you can tell that I had like purple hair um, what I was aiming more for though was like my full hair be purple but it was hard because, as you can see, my hair is like dark. Well, from the side, it's dark. This right here, I did not dye it. This is, I'm trying to grow all this out. This is just hair that, it's like dye, I guess. So it's taking a while, but I, I don't want to dye my hair anymore. Fact number 10, I used to live in Huntington Park. So my childhood was in Huntington Park. So I used to know the Pacific, I used to go there all the time. I used to go to Milton Street School. I did not, get the chance to go to Gage, but I was gonna go, but that's when I moved here. And I was gonna go to HP High, but I moved here, so I went to Paramount. But I know like over there, like the Salt Lake Park, just everything over there. Fact number 11, I love scary movies, 
scary conspiracy theories and like paranormal stuff i love watching videos on youtube about it like if something random comes to my head something scary i'll watch it i got my sister into it she likes watching scary videos now um i have not had a movie that has been scary for me lately probably the one that kind of got me was the conjuring that one was pretty scary when it the first one when it first came out but other than that like I haven't really been scared to a point where like I can't sleep at night like no but if I were to ever witness or have anything crazy like I get so scared like something that would happen to me I would oh I'm so scared I love scary movies but I'm scared of like scary paranormal stuff I don't know if that even makes sense fact number 12 it actually leads to that so I've actually had like the dead on me when I was sleeping I guess they also call it like sleep paralysis one night I just when I used to live here in my mom's house, like before I got pregnant, I couldn't like get up. It was weird, like I felt like getting up, but I couldn't. I felt something really like heavy on top of me, and I was like freaking out, and I was just very like scared after. But um, yeah, it was so scary. Like I would go to sleep, and then one time my mom, she would like try to like touch my hair or something, or like touch me, and I like. I like flinched and jumped up. It was so scary. Like even talking about it and like reminding me about it, it just freaks me out. But it was really scary. But not until my mom then put Agua Bendita all around the room and then after that like it stopped. Act number 13. I'm very sensitive. I am a very sensitive person. Like if Brian jokes around with me, I'll take it up the bit. I get about hurt so easily. But I know that that's how he is, so now I've gotten super used to it. But um when it comes to like if I do something wrong at a job or something, like I'll take it super harsh. Um, even if the person's not even trying to be harsh, like that's just how I am. Like I'm very sensitive about everything. It sucks. Fact number fourteen: I used to suck my thumb when I was little. So I got lucky that I did not suck my thumb for a long time because usually when kids like use a pacifier or suck their thumbs, like their teeth come out. So luckily, I stopped. When I went to preschool, that's when I did suck my thumb because I was embarrassed of like all the little kids looking at me or like the teachers and stuff. So my mom said that I would come home and then right away like I would like start sucking my thumb. But good thing I stopped at a certain age. Fact number 15, I used to have braces in freshman. In freshman. I used to have braces when I was a ninth grader. So I only had braces for a year and a half. I didn't really have like crooked teeth, but um, my bottom teeth, they were, the dentist told me that if I didn't get braces during the years, my teeth would like go on top of each other. I didn't wear my retainer as much as I needed to after my braces got taken off, but so now they're a bit crooked again, but I probably will get them um, on again. Fact number 16, I'm scared of roller coasters. Like I really am. I'm really scared. I can't go to Six Flags because I'm a weenie and I'm scared as hell. And every time I'm about to get on a ride, a scary ride, because someone makes me, <sighs> I can never have anybody talk to me because one, I'm mad, and two, I'm freaking scared. Um, the last time I ever went to Six Flags, I was it was when I was in eighth grade and never again you guys I went on Goliath and I was dying I swear to you it was so scary like I'm so scared of roller coasters I hate that feeling in your stomach that you get when like they drop and all that stuff Ugh, no fact number 17 I am a Gemini where are my Gemini's at if you are a Gemini give this video a thumbs up my birthday is June 5th so that leads into the Gemini say that Gemini's have two personalities no it does not mean that we're fake um, but I truly believe that because when I'm sober I'm one person but when I am drunk I am a complete total different person if you guys have seen me drunk you guys would know what I'm talking about <laughs> um, but yeah I'm totally different I'm like more like hey oh my god it's, it's crazy fact number 18 I have different laughs I have different laughs, so sometimes I laugh normal, other times I laugh super loud, other times I laugh like my mom. Like if you have me on Snapchat, sometimes you can hear me laugh. And I know you guys probably don't pay attention to that, but I do have like different laughs for depending how funny the like how funny something was. Fact number 19, I've only broken my wrist and I fractured my ankle. So I broke my wrist. No, 
I broke my wrist when I was seven. I was riding a bike that was smaller than I was and I made a harsh turn and I felt like this on the concrete and I put all my weight on top of my arm. So I ended up breaking it and oh my God, like, I remember how bad it was hurting. Like, I couldn't move it, I had to stay like this. I was like, mom, like, I was crying. And then I fractured my ankle when I was pregnant. I was like eight months pregnant and it was raining outside. I had my van slip on shoes and I slipped and um, I like twisted my ankle really bad. All my weight went on top of my ankle and then I had to go to the ER and yeah, I got super swollen. And they told me that I fractured it. And I had to be in crutches, you guys. Being pregnant and being on crutches, not a good combo. Let me tell you. Fact number 20, I used to be a cheerleader in middle school. I used to be the flyer. If you guys don't know what that is, it's like you know, when the two girls pick up the girl and they're up there, you know? I don't know, sorry, that's the best way I can explain it, but yeah, I used to be that. One time I fell, though, like we were practicing, like, and then they picked me up, and then I don't know what happened, but I fell, no one caught me, and I fell on my right side right here, and to this day I have like a dent in my rib. It's crazy. Fact number 21. I was a distance runner in cross country and track and field. I miss running. I used, I ran just for my junior year in high school and I was like, I was not like freaking good, but I think I was pretty good, like average, you know. Fact number 22. I'm very good at typing on the computer. I swear to you guys, like I got good at typing on the computer because of being on MySpace so much and like when I was what MySpace existed when we were like what like 13 I don't know um but yeah like I used to always like be on MySpace and now I can freaking like type without looking at the keyboard like I type super fast and it's it's cool because it comes in handy actually fact number 23 I used to be super skinny like skinny like my sister look at her She's skinny. I used to be really skinny like her. The lowest I've ever weighed was like 98 pounds. And I, it was so hard for me to gain weight and then I would like gain it and then I would lose weight out of nowhere and I wasn't even trying to lose weight. But now, girl, I'm weighing the most I've ever weighed. Fact number 24. I got my first set of acrylic nails when I was 12 years old. I remember I got French tip nails. I was like, mom, mom, like I want nails. I want to see how it feels. And she's like, no, 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 no. But then after, I don't know, like I convinced her. And we went and I went to a spot, I believe in the Lakewood Mall. And um, yeah, I had French tip nails. They were medium length and I felt cool. <laughs> yeah, you me, you know. Okay. Fact number 25, I have fallen in front of people only one time, like a group of people. When I was <laughs> when I was a junior in high school, I had PE for zero period, and we had to like run in the in the track. We had to do like sprints, and so then like we do sprints, and the people are all right there like lined up in front of you. So then I just like was running back, and I don't know what happened, and I fell, and I like slid. So I hurt like my chest right here, it was like this, but I felt like this. And then everyone's like, I thought people would be laughing, but everyone was like. <gasps> Fact number 26, I won't even to Mexico, Washington DC, and Florida, Orlando. I mean, so far. So I will keep you guys updated. Where else I have gone? Fact number 27. I won a free trip to Washington DC. It was actually a really fun trip and I missed school senior year for a week. So I was able to get permission to like leave for a week to go to this um, trip. And it was pretty much like a raffle like for my dad's job. All the employees who had kids in high school, like they wrote their names and then whoever got picked out got to win the free trip for a week. And surely enough, it was me. And it was so much fun. Like Washington DC is really cool. The museums over there are really like much better over there. I actually got to meet a lot of people from different like places and my roommates that I had were the best. Two of them were for Rhode Island and one of them was for Minnesota. And to this day, I have them on Instagram. And we've been trying to like meet up like somewhere for years already, but <laughs> it's okay. One day it'll happen. Fact number 28, I've never had a quinceañera. And it just, it's, 
it's like I don't feel like I don't regret it like I just I was never into that stuff so I just didn't want one and surely you know it just never happened fact number 29 my name Marlene is Colombian my mom said that my dad like heard that name from a Colombian novella and he was just like I like that name so ever since that that's what my name ended up being Marlene fact number 30 so I I don't like the guys. I don't like um, mole. I don't like mushrooms. Oh, I don't like onions. Well, onion. Well, Brian, he loves onions, so he's always telling me eat onions, eat onions. So sometimes I do eat them. And also, I don't like like gordito from meat. I'm super picky with my meat. Like I like mushy, like well done. But Brian has been helping me, like you know, start eating it less than well done so so far I've tried like medium well and I've tried a little bit like where it has a little pink in there so it was not that bad but mm. you know he has he has helped me like try new things so I'm thankful for him sorry you guys my camera died so I'm just gonna continue the video here so fact number 31 is that I used to have a lip piercing but I used to have I have the scar here still to this day I got this when I was in eighth grade I think I did it myself so I did this one myself I also had another one over here but this one I ended up taking off because it was getting infected so I had what they call snake bites and um, I also had a nose piercing and I used to have um, my ear cartilage act number 30 Two, yeah 32 is that I went to a concert by myself and honestly it was the best time I've ever had it was the Lana Del Rey concert it was so much fun I was turning up by myself and the last fact number 33 is that I did not get my license until I was 20 because I had like a little phobia of driving at one point and then I just kept lagging it and well, anyways, you guys, that is it for this video. I hope you guys learned a lot about me. Sorry that my sister comes out, she's playing her little video games. Or not. Anyway, hey. oh my god. So, as hey. always, thank you guys so much for watching. <gasps> Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed watching it. We'll see you guys next time. Bye!